I've started to develop a crush on my teacher. What is this? Pretty Little Liars? Ezra? Aria? Hi, hello everyone, it's Tani here and welcome back to my channel. So the other day I did a video where I did choosing no for everything. So in that video I also mentioned, oh my god, I should do another video of me choosing surprise me for everything. Where we literally have no control, the game controls it. So it's essentially, bit life controls my bit life. When I think about that, it's kind of trippy, but that's what it is. Really quickly before we get into the video, make sure you guys go check out my social media. I have Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, Twitch, and TikTok. And I also just reopened my cameo for only a dollar because why not? And really quickly, today's post notification shout out goes to Greatness Obsessed. So thank you for turning on my notifications. That being said, let's get into bit life controls my bit life. So again, I've done a video like this on my channel before, but again, that was years ago when there were so many less options and stuff. That was when like the surprise me option literally just got released. So today I'm doing it again. And I do this sometimes for fun as well, but I haven't done it in a while. So I want to do this. So how it works is basically anytime an option pops up, we have to pick surprise me if that's the case. And in order to do that as well, I'm also going to make my actual life random. So I'm not going to like actually be able to control this. I'm going to use the refresh option and I'll refresh five times so we can have a life that's completely random. So one, two, Three, four, five. Okay, so here we have Emily Huss. She's female from Germany. Special talent will be music. I wanna see her appearance. Okay, brown hair, blue eyes. And her attributes are low discipline, medium fertility, medium happiness, high health, 1% karma. That's not gonna be good. 5% looks. She's straight. She's. <laughs> Emily has a very unfortunate life. 20% smarts, 20% willpower. Well, we're gonna start Emily's life. So the. Oh, at least she's a Virgo, like me. What pants? <laughs> While playing at the park, you accidentally pee yourself. <sighs> why do we always pee ourselves when we're kids? I mean, I understand why. Surprise me. Get wet before it. I think this is a typo. I think it should say get dry before anyone notices, but it says get wet. Anyway, surprise me. Okay, so we went home. Okay, we're five. There's a squabble. Me and my half-brother, Janique, are squabbling about who ate the last cookie. Insult him, complain to mother, attack him, or apologize. Surprise me. We're going to juvie. How much do you want to bet we're about to go to juvie? Well, this is the automatic one that came up, so pinch his throat. Okay, didn't do, <laughs> didn't do a lot of damage. Okay, we're not a juvenile five-year-old. I can breathe. Primary school, okay. My half-brother got tonsillitis. Ha. <laughs> um, okay, there's no surprise to me here, so I guess I'll actually try and do it. Boom! Period. Oh gosh, a free kick opportunity. We have an opportunity to play in a kid's soccer league. Not a chance, sign me up, or maybe I'll try another sport. Sign me up, please. Surprise me. Ah, oh, not a chance. I've started to develop a crush on my teacher. What is this, Pretty Little Liars? Ezra, Aria. My classmate Nelle has been teasing me every day about my socioeconomic status. That's messed up. What will you do? Report it to the headmaster, do nothing about it. Ooh, I wanna attack her, but surprise me. Yo, a bit likes listening. They know what I want. They know what I'm here for. <laughs> Slap her throat. I'm going to juvie. I didn't go to juvie. Oh my gosh, my sister Pauline was the result of a random Tinder hookup. I mean, go Pauline. Oh my gosh, you have an opportunity to have your first kiss with a boy named Frederick. <laughs> Kissing but no tongue. Oh my gosh. Oh my god, I have a lipstick on my teeth. <sighs> Tell me you grew up as an introvert without telling you you grew up as an introvert. There's no way in hell I would have had my first kiss at that. School dance. Okay, we're attracted to a boy named Luther, but it's not Frederick. Rise me. <gasps> go by myself. I always went to dances by myself. Having a date is overrated. Movie theater. Okay. The boy next door. Ooh. <laughs> no, we love enemies to lovers, not friends to lovers. We love enemies to lovers over here. That sounds boring. <laughs> Cause it is. We need enemies. We need like the school bully or something. I've been thinking about how odd it is that feet smell while noses run. Interesting. Music lessons. You have an opportunity to take lessons with a famous music teacher. <gasps> Oh my god, is this someone from Glee? <laughs> what instrument will you choose? Flute, guitar, trumpet, or banjo? Surprise me. Trumpet. We're in secondary school finally. Extracurriculars. Oh gosh, are we gonna do extracurriculars? Surprise me. Let's see. Okay, we are. What should we do? Glee. Our, mu our special talent is music, so let's do Glee Club. <laughs> I think my teacher may be experiencing gas issues. Family vacation. Your mother wants to take you and your siblings on a family vacation to Winnipeg. Surprise me. I would like to go. I guess not. Driver's test. Okay, this is important because it decides whether or not we're having an Olivia Rodrigo moment 
or not surprise me take the test okay that is right lane ends and period oh my god a nissan ultima asks for a more expensive car but i have to choose surprise me i said turn it down Okay, we're 18. We graduated. This will decide. Do we get a job, go to university, or take time off? University. <laughs> Emily can't catch a break. Um, oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I'll choose the program, but then we have to choose Surprise Me for, um, oh, wait, no. I have to choose what it does automatically. Tanya, hello, you can't choose anything. Okay, so we are going to uni. Free public uni though, that's good. I'll join an activity. We'll do dance club. Amazing. Um, and that's pretty much it. Ooh, faculty, ooh. Oh my God, I thought that said Dr. Crumb. <laughs> Low professionalism. Hey, bestie. Oh no, it was so successful. <laughs> that didn't happen. Let's just move on. Just pretend that never happened. It's fine, it's fine. Sage, dance. <laughs> <laughs> I was yeeted from dance club. Pauline started middle school. Nah, he tweaking. On the heelish heels of Little Nas X, Tony Hawk just partnered with Liquid Death to create 500 ultimate limited edition skateboards that have paint infused with Birdman's... I have not heard of this. He has blood in his skateboard? Isn't that a biohazard? You recognize that blood merch is becoming a thing and begin to wonder which celebrity's blood will be marketed next. This is an overwhelming selection, but surprise me. <laughs> Kylie Jenner blood lipstick. Isn't blood a biohazard? On our way to the dentist, we witness a millennial. <laughs> I love how they <laughs> I love how they specified that it was a millennial. <laughs> like not a boomer, not Gen X, it was a millennial. <laughs> Surprise me. Try to intervene. Oh my gosh, the millennial lunged at me. She scraped my ovaries. Fight back, but I can't, cause surprise me. <gasps> Bite her neck, oh my God, Edward Cullen. You bit her neck, then you seized her by the collar in a merciless nutcracker chokehold until she cried for mercy. I'm going to jail. That was self-defense. She called the cops on me. Bro, it was self-defense. Surprise me. Flirt with them. Well, I don't have money, so public defender. Dude, that was literally self-defense. She attacked me for. She attacked me first. She attacked me first. <sighs> you broke me first. Uh, judge has asked you make a plea deal. Surprise me. <laughs> for one year. Not guilty. I'm in prison. It's not fair. I was, it was self-defense. It was self-defense. I was literally forced to drop out. Oh, what is this video turned into? <gasps> How long was my hair on the tree? Oh no. <laughs> this tree, I swear. How long was my hair on the tree? I really hope it just happened. That was never an issue before. <laughs> I don't know what to do now. I think I need to start some like ruckus now as revenge. I'm gonna join a gang. Some gangs in minimum security prison. How unfortunate. Okay, um, prison job. Let's do a landscaper. I'm so sad. That was literally self-defense. Can I sue her? Oh, should I attempt to escape? <laughs> I'm attempting to escape from prison. What are you going to do about it? The garden's twice for every move you make. I have not done this in so long. I think it's this way. And I trap him there. Yup. Oh! <laughs> that was wrong. Oh, two year. Oh, I've received mail from my half-sister Pauline. She sent me a letter of support. Surprise me. Okay, we kept it. <laughs> I keep getting lipstick in my teeth. Okay, I'm escaping again. I know my my sentence is literally only one year, but I don't care. Okay, I want to see if I remember how to do these. I need to stop. I, <laughs> I need to stop. My sentence went from one year to four. <laughs> I need to stop. While in the infirmary, I bump into a fellow prisoner named Enu who's in slam, who's in the slammer for public urination. Surprise me. Of course, a bit life says to insult her, and now she's gonna beat me up. I'm showing a bit. She stormed me. She grappled my nipple. That was so aggressive. The audacity. Anyways, can I join a gang now? Put me in a medium security prison. Oh, I should bribe the guards. I need to stop. I need to be able to leave prison. I'm gonna stop, let's age. Pollution problem, you are unbelievably thirsty, but the only drinking fountain available is atop the toilet that 
A nasty inmate has been defecating in for the last 50 minutes. I'd rather die of thirst, but surprise me, they're gonna choose drink it. How did I know? We gotta get out of prison. <laughs> Please don't make me attack this person. Well, in the workshop, you bump into a fellow prisoner named Horny Steffi, <laughs> who, who was busted. <laughs> Surprise me, please don't attack her. I swear. Pinch her neck. I'm going to prison for the rest of my life, aren't I? Oh, I'm not. I left her with a bruised brain though. How interesting. Oh gosh, we've received mail again from Pauline. Surprise me. Okay, at least we're keeping a good relationship with her. Oh, we're finally released. Thank goodness. I don't know what to do now. <laughs> oh God, my happiness is low. My health is low. Let's just see what happens. My friends are joining Instagram. Surprise me. I guess I signed up, okay. Oh, I don't have depression anymore. My mother's shouting me about having a job. Surprise me. Oh, thank gosh we can get a job. Oh, I have a criminal record though. Retail. Damn it. Prentice pet groomer. No, app tester. Oh my gosh, I can't do anything. Cashier. Farmer. Security guard. I can't do anything. Exotic dancer. Okay, do you have any questions for us? I'm not going to get the job. <laughs> Surprise me. What are your expectations for this role? It worked, okay. Period, 26K a year. We'll work harder one time. And then that bit life do the rest. Oh gosh, my supervisor has been taken a liking to me and has asked me to attend a juggling class with him. <sighs> Surprise me. Oh, we declined. Thank goodness we declined. Oh no, <laughs> a young man named Fonzo invites me to a nude beach. Let's go, let's have some fun. Oh, surprise me. <laughs> Take him to bed. Let's go. Emily needs this. What, are we gonna get pregnant? Surprise me. Oh no. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> oh my God. My friends are all joining Twitter. Surprise me. Okay, we're, I guess BitLife is letting us be on social media. Sure. A male you met while sitting on a park bench has asked me on a date. Carl Zimmerman. He's a busser at Heirloom Restaurant. Surprise me. Thank goodness I did not want to date him. Okay, let's increase our health and age. Backstage privileges. <laughs> While at a Clay Aiken concert, a bodyguard invites me backstage only if we perform s on him. Surprise me, bit life, you always do. <laughs> I'm starting to think that a direct kick to the crotch should be standard protocol for manspreading on a Disney bus. A male you met while at an Elton John. Sing along to Elton John. Surprise me. Thank goodness I don't want to date these people. I just realized my karma was so low that that's why I'm getting all the bad options. <laughs> oh no. Termination. You've been fired because I told everyone my Valentine's Day plans were to go home and make love to myself. <laughs> I want to insult my supervisor. Come on. Oh, wish my supervisor well. How boring. Come on, that's amazing. I said I'm going to go make love to myself on Valentine's Day. Someone hacked into my Instagram and posted I love negative comments on my account. Surprise me. It's gonna say delete it. <laughs> I knew it. Oh my god. I had the account for years and it deleted it. Some of your friends are going to a local nightclub called Big Load Disco. Surprise me. I want to go to this. Come on. It's called Big Load Disco. How can you not go? You have the- Oh my gosh. You have the opportunity to have a one night stand with a married male? Oh, we gotta do it. Please, bit life. Yes. Please make him not use one. We need it to be scandalous. Oh, I want it to be scandalous. I want it to be the mistress. Damien contacted us, you guys. Our hookup. <laughs> Damien. Damien Salvatore, is that you? Um, surprise me. Go see him. Go see him. Yes. Yes. Surprise me. Do it. Do it. No. <laughs> I want to be the mistress. I want to be scandalous. I'm going to attempt that one more time. I'm going to break the rules. Um, message him. What do you call? Okay, he rejected me. I'm hurt. Okay, let's just eat. During your lunch break, you encounter a drifter leering at you. I don't know what a drifter is. Uh, surprise me. Attack. I'm going back to prison. Pinch his throat. I'm, go I'm going back to prison. <laughs> I'm going back to prison. Cooperate. <gasps> I'll be able to get out. Knock. Oh my god. I accidentally pressed not guilty. So I broke the rules. So I do actually deserve to go to prison. I, I forgot to press surprise me. It's just natural instinct for me to click not guilty. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. Crusty eyes. Oh, that's the worst feeling ever when you have stuff in your eye. Go to the doctor. Okay. 
Dr. Luther, is that the person we hooked up with? <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, surprise me, pink eye. Treat me? Oh, they passed. This is gonna kill me. This is gonna be the thing that kills me. While out for a walk, a monk offers me Valium. Surprise me. <laughs> oh no. <gasps> okay, nothing bad happened. Difficulty sleeping. We're, we're having some health issues. When you go to bed at night, your mind begins racing around in circles so intensely that you're having difficult time falling asleep. We have insomnia. Ah, uh, search the web. <laughs> Google, Dr. Google. Oh, surprise me. Aspirin. <laughs> Surprise me, horse races. Oh gosh, I'm betting all my money. No, I meant to bet all my money. <laughs> Shit, it's okay. It's fine. We we went with the red horse. Come on, come on. <laughs> Dead last. <laughs> Fourth place. <gasps> my half brother Janique has a friend who works at a cologne company. Oh no, sorry, Cologne Community Church. <laughs> a job as an exorcist. Take the job, please. Please take the job. Oh my god, I'm an exorcist. <laughs> my mom passed away. Oh my god, I'm gonna get all her money. Donate her body to science. She left it all to my siblings. Okay, that, that was an appropriate mother. How could you? Well, since I'm an exorcist, I wanna get a haunted house or like something. Oh, there's none. <gasps> haunted King Kong mortgage. Oh wait, no, mortgage. Ah, oh, you just realized that your coworker Maria made a jello mold and that your cell phone is resting visibly inside. I'm gonna attack her, aren't I? Oh, have a talk with her, okay. Can I afford a house now that's haunted? Please, I want I'm an exorcist, I need a haunted house. A bottle of water filled with tequila. There, I literally have so many song references. You know how they do that? What, what company on YouTube, what channel on YouTube does like the song association? I would be so good at that. The word love. You're making me a boy with love. Uh, the word... Chair. Okay, I give up. <laughs> I'm addicted to alcohol. Oh no. Well, at a party, a tap dancer calls me a whole bag. Surprise me. I'm gonna attack them, aren't I? Oh, I forgave him. Oh, I've been fired. Insult them, please. Ah. Oh. Don't beg for anyone. Oh no, this is the thing that's gonna kill me. I'm gonna attack him and then he's gonna attack me and kill me. Surprise me. I knew it. Grab his arm. I knew it. He called. I am going to prison. Please insult them. Surprise me again. Oh my god. Okay, if it does not guilty, we could be okay. Surprise me. Received mail from Pauline again. We love Pauline. Pauline, literally every single year we have been in prison, our whole life, she always sent me a package. I've been released. I need to go show Pauline some love. You're no longer suffering from depression. Okay, but we do have joint pain. Surprise me. Pray. A masked gunman is attempting to rob a clerk while you are waiting in line at the bank. I'm gonna die. Surprise me. <gasps> he died. I kind of don't want to increase my health because it's kind of scandalous. <gasps> Someone called Pauline an inbreeder. Surprise me. Oh no. Why does <laughs> why do I attack everyone? We gave her a karate chop to the gullet, bruising her larynx. <gasps> I didn't go to jail. It's over. It's over. Surprise me. I didn't die. Yo! Emily is, has like 10 lives. You just observed the doctor call Pauline weak sauce. Surprise me. I hope we attack him. Right hook his mouth. He called the cops. I don't even care. Surprise me. I uh, bribe them. Give them all my money. <laughs> Shit, they arrested me anyway. I can't even afford a lawyer. Surprise me. Not guilty. Damn it. Eight years. This is where my life ends. Pauline is literally the best sister in the world. She sends me a package every time. Send her a thank you letter. <gasps> I have heart cancer. Oh no, I am gonna die. Well, in the cafeteria, we bump into a fellow prisoner named, named Nave Fritzi, who was busted for violating a restraining order. We're gonna attack her, aren't we? Compliment her. We called her a ray of sunshine. She attacked me with a club. I'm dead. I, I, I literally got attacked with a club until I died. What? 
I couldn't even see Pauline again. This was a sad, this is a fun life, but it was also sad. Emily Huss's antics came to an abrupt halt at the age of 70. I didn't even realize how old I was, 71. Her funeral was attended by her two siblings, Janique and Pauline. We love Pauline. Everyone needs a Pauline. No, everyone should be a Pauline. An aggressive young lady, Emily worked as an exotic dancer for many years. Rumor has it she once tried eating elk burgers. I love how that was something that was like so remarkable about us. There we go, guys. Bit life surprised me. Controlling my bit life. I hope you enjoyed. <laughs>